what just happened? Like, literally, I just watched Akamiga Kill episode 20, and I'm going to do a review on it. But at the same time, I'm starting to have some doubt at a certain point. Because right now, things are just getting a little um complicated for me for the meantime. I mean, I've been keeping up um, with, I've been, you know, I'll be honest with you guys, I've been keeping up with the manga that's, like, close to the anime, you know? I mean, like, um, so far, I'll be honest with you, I've been hearing, like, many rumors that, like, um, I've been hearing rumors from my, um, friends that, like, um, there's gonna be an original anime ending, which is to my worry, because I don't want that to happen, if anything else, because right now, like, things are getting a little tough for me here and there. So far, like, um, when I looked at this episode, I'm not really sure what's, what's exactly happening. Like, I don't know what's exactly happening for the meantime, because, like, um, yeah, I really don't know what's really happening right now. I mean... I see to it that I did take a look at the chapters and I did like make some comparisons and so far I'll be honest with you they seem to be adapting it properly maybe I'm not really sure they missed a couple scenes out but still um I, this episode was pretty surprising though I've been hearing from my friends like um I've been hearing from my friends like um this episode was just plain bullshit bull it you know or dog it you know I'm trying to make sure I control my cursing, you know, and I and I know it gets annoying once in a while, but still. Uh, but I think this episode seemed to be okay, but you know, like, the next episode, I just see the next episode preview, I don't know what to expect, but things are just gonna get a little, like, um, tough. So if anything else, I'll just get started right away. I'm sorry for wasting so much time to tell you what's up right now with me and the Akami got killed, but I'm starting to love, but I really love this series to my heart's delight, okay? So if anything else, I, I like to get started. Okay, you know, we see to it that we have a new character, and this guy seems to be... This guy seems to be like part of the part of the cap part of the defending the capital type of thing, you know. But honestly, like um, I do not know what to expect exactly. But um, his name is I think the guy's is um, name. I'm not I'm not sure what the guy's name is, but he he seems to be very very strong for some reason, you know. But um, uh. Don't really know, you know. I don't really know what's up and so forth, but we have this character who could who control time and space, and his name is Shura. It's the same guy we saw a couple episodes back or something, you know. Speaking of like um, anything else, like um, we see to it that this the this commander, we see to it that like um, that after the opening, you know, as always, we see to it that Wave and Ron and Chromie are talking to each other, you know, having fun. But you see here. Most of the Jaegers are, like, taken out completely, you know? And, so far, like, um, Kurumi, on the other hand, falls into, um, falls into a, co fall, just dies out or something again. And we see to it that Leone and Mine are talking to each other, and Leone's like, hey, how'd you and Tatsumi go, you know? And, Tats and Nagenda, um, Ak Ak Akame and Susano ends up saying that, ends up, Getting ready for the plan. As for Labak and Tatsumi, um, Labak says he's gonna go and make, gonna make some, uh, make his bookstore into a franchise after he's done, you know? And so far, like, um, so far, like, um, I don't know what to expect, you know? Um, Tatsumi says, like, um, he doesn't really know, but Labak asks him, like, hey, 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 are you gonna, like, um, have some, fun with mine or something, have you even kissed, and they end up being, they end up seeing that woman says she's part of the resistance, and I'm thinking in my mind, I do not think you should trust her, because it seems really like, um, stupid, and honestly, honestly, when they got to a certain house, there was a trap by Shura, and he decides, and then we end up having this commander coming here, and ends up fighting the commander-in-chief, Budo, I believe, but he, he therefore says, like, um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna punish you, with the weapon I have, with the weapon I have, you know, and therefore, like, um, things got a little tough for him now, T tough for Tatsumi, and now, like, um, he transforms, and so forth, and Labak ends up facing Shura, but that did not come out so well, because, like, um, let me see here, um, uh, because the guy's teleporting everywhere, but Shura says, like, um, Shura says, like, um, 
and gets tired once in a while, but he ends up having a drug, in, he ends up entering a drug inside him, you know, and therefore, like, um, he ends up teleporting everywhere, Lebok tries to fight him, but he teleports in the air too, which is to my surprise, pretty much, any, any mark he makes is pretty much nothing more than usual, as for the, um, commander in chief facing Tatsumi, he was about to go head to head with them, but Tatsumi ends up being defeated by his intense lightning strike, and Therefore, um, we see to it that we have um, Shura. We have that Shura end up slicing a woman in the neck for trying to stop for for, for, for trying to stop Lebok and trying to be, get killed. You know, I go see what I mean when you try to trust someone. Damn. And then like um, and then like um, Shura says, I told you not to interfere. And we're not even done playing yet. Shura says, but Lebok says, Oh, we're done playing. And then he goes like, What? And then, and then like um, his hand gets cut off and says he made a lot of threads, you know. And therefore he says, sure, there are many questions I have to ask right now. And he talks to, and Lebok gets stabbed by that, by the woman. I'm going, what the hell, she's still alive? And sure says, like, please free my mother and father. But he goes, like, your mother and father are dead. And by the time, like, um, sure ends up using, uh, using his hidden ability, but to teleport Labak in the desolate world, but thanks to Labak, he said, you can't sever this thread, he takes him with him, and then, he therefore, um, sl he says, let's go together, huh, and then he's, and he, and then Labak ends up using a pole-like thing, and sh shoved it down, um, uh, Shura's chest, and then he crushes his heart, and therefore, they both fall, they both are fallen, and as for, Labak, he ends up falling too, you know, and he goes like, leave the rest of you now, talk to me. Then he gets skewered by a bunch of spikes, and I go like, what? What? And that's when Tatsumi screams, and then, you know, the minister goes like, no, sure, how could you die? And he doesn't give a shit. It's like that. Sorry for cursing right there. And I go like, wow, as expected of the minister. He cares nothing but himself, you know, and so forth. And by that time, it's like, um... Wow, dude. Um, just wow. Um, and then, like, um, the minister says he wants to take care of his punishment, but Ezra says, I'll step up. And then she goes, I won't let anyone have you, Tatsumi. And then, there's a public notice that, like, uh, Tatsumi is to be executed in public. I go, like, oh, boy, not good. And I did see the episode preview so far, and... I did see the um, episode preview, and it says "Kill the Despair" or something. Like, literally, I don't know what to expect, but right now things are just getting tough, and it looks like maybe Ezdet and Tatsumi are gonna be facing off against each other. That's the only thing I'm gonna say. So all I know is like um, this um, episode. I'll be honest with you, it is cool to see my bucket skewered. I don't really know what happens, but I think I accidentally took a sneak peek around Google and kind of ruined it myself a bit, but I'm not going to tell you it because, like, I don't know. All I know is, it's like, um, things are getting a little dark again. Like, I hope, I'm not really sure what happened to LeBoc, but for him to get skewered on the stomach or something, like, oh, man, I don't know if he actually survived that, but I don't, I don't think he survived that, but still. I don't know how, I don't know how he died in the manga, but, yeah. So, if anything else, um... Yeah, I, I'll end my review right here because right now things are just getting a little nasty now. So if anything else, I'll end it here, people. I'm out for zero. Have a good day, and I'll see you in my next video, alright? Later. Peace out. Bye-bye.